We do want people to have homes. We do want them to have appropriate homes for them that are where they can feel safe and stable. Not everybody does in four up walls. And even if you provide somebody with the flats, there can be times because of their issues they may have had in, had in the past that they just can't sleep inside and they might be found sleeping outside. Now the police who do a sweep every morning uh, around the city know these people. And in actual fact, if they see them there, they check they're healthy and well, and they may just walk off and leave them because they do understand. And others will be directed to wherever they need to be directed to get a, whole, a safe bed for the night. There's always a problem. And when it gets really cold, the people who normally would be left by the people, the police or the ambassadors or the other charities that walk and I can't remember the name now, but that's where they were. Walk the streets at night and because they some of our councillors, I'm going back a bit now, but some of the councillors on the working cross party working group went out and walked the streets of Sheffield between four and six in the morning and they did the rough sleep account. And they looked at where the people were, they checked they were all right, they offered them beds if they needed them, they directed them where they could get hot food if they needed them. Um, and they made sure um, that there was nothing unusual out there. Uh, and they saw for themselves and came back and reported back to the cross-party working group what they actually saw with their own eyes.